So this OG just went off on all the fellas that he feel do not contribute and don't deserve women to submit to them. Every time I turn around, one of these relationship gurus is always telling women what they need to do to attract and keep a man. And they are putting themselves on pedestals that some of them should be knocked the fuck off of. So allow me to be the first person with the opening salvo. Some of you men don't get the submission that you want because you ain't shit and you need to be honest with yourself. For example, some of you had goals that you set for your life that you did not achieve in any way, shape, form, or fashion, which means you are a failure in your own eyes based on what you wanted to do. That's the first part. Secondly, you need to look at the surrounding, the men surrounding you. Let's be honest. You don't know what the fuck mas what makes masculinity at all because your daddy wasn't shit, uncles wasn't shit, your cousins wasn't shit, your grandfather wasn't shit. They all passed this half-assed version of masculinity and now you running with it like you know what the fuck you're talking about when in actuality you don't. Some of you are selfish as shit. You expect a woman to bend the motherfucking knee to you simply because you were born with a penis when in actuality you ain't shit. You cannot handle your own finances. You do not take care of your own responsibility. Some of you barely wash your motherfucking ass. You dress like your ass is 25 instead of 45, 50, 60 years old. Some of you have not let go of the fact that your hair is leaving your fucking head. You do not understand the concept of pleasuring your partner. But you expect her to put all kinds of shit in her motherfucking mouth where you'll stay downtown long enough to see whether or not the grass is growing and then come to fuck up. You are in this box of what masculinity is. Your little narrow ass, fucked up ass box of what masculinity is. Black fingernail polish and earrings. Oh God, he can't be a man. But you don't know what the fuck a man is because your daddy boned the fuck out when your ass was a toddler. Y'all expect women not to be independent, submit to your asses, begging or uh, demanding a woman move into a house that's still under construction. Maybe it's not her. Maybe it's not them. Maybe it's your motherfucking ass. The reason you're not getting what you want from women is because you are shit and you will not accept that. Is any of this making sense to you? It's time that we wake up, fellas. All of us ain't got it, you feel me? All of us ain't got the sauce. And, you know, you know I'm all for my fellas, man. I'm always for the guys, but we gotta be honest, man. What really uh, gets on my nerves the most about this generation and about this era that we're in is when dudes walk around saying, oh, I'm having a hard time ha making her submit. I'm, have, I'm just wondering why she won't submit to me or why won't she let me take the lead? You know, I'm the man, I'm supposed to take the lead. She's supposed to follow. I'm the, I'm the, I'm the, I'm the, uh, I'm the man, she's the rib. You know, she's the rib of me. How come she's not following? See, these women, they just don't understand. No, you just ain't got the sauce. And we gotta be honest, for real, for real, bro. You gotta think, man, when we look at these comments, most people that leave comments, when you click, when you click, if you get 10 people and you click all the crazy comments that you feel like is, uh, you know, um, ain't really useful like that, not tangible like that. If you look at everybody's profile, over 50% of them be looking dysfunctional. They look deformed, right? You feel me? And uh, we got to understand there are still scrubs out here, a lot of them. The world ain't really doing so well as far as the economy. Uh, we're in the heat of a dang on recession. Scamming is at its all time high. And we know one thing that, that in this generation with chicks, women, they got their hands out like this. They want it the way they want it. They want you to pay for it all. How y'all brothers getting the money? How y'all getting the money uh, in, a, in, a, in a climate where the employment rate it has pretty much dropped because don't nobody want to go to work. So what are y'all doing? How y'all walk around with all the gooey luchi and everything because everybody out here scamming doing something they ain't got no business doing? Not everybody, but a lot of folks are. So a lot of fellas be out here demanding things that they really do not deserve at all. And ladies, you're not wrong. You're not wrong. A lot of y'all do be wrong now, but you're not wrong, especially when it comes to a dusty. When you a dusty, you're just a dusty and there's nothing you can do about it when somebody has their mind made up or your actions already uh, portray that. 
or display that, right? But um, yeah, man, fellas, everybody ain't got it all, man. You gotta you gotta work on yourself. You gotta make sure things are in order in your life in order for someone to submit to you. You asking for someone to give their whole life to you. You drive the wheel, they just sit up in the car. And that's not a very um, bright thing to do, especially when they see a bunch of red flags. What are y'all thoughts about this right here? <laughs>